Hi. Welcome to SKM Tutorials Hub. This is the second video of HTML series. In the previous video, we had a brief introduction to HTML. You'll get the link of that video in the description box. Today we will learn how to create our first HTML web page. So, let's get started. <music> As I have said in the last video, we only need a text editor, and a web browser for creating HTML web pages. So I have opened Notepad here. You may use any of the text editors of your choice. As you already know, the first line must be doctype declaration. In previous versions of HTML, you had to mention the HTML version like this. But in the current version, that is HTML5. You don't need to mention the version. I have forgot to mention about HTML element in the last video. HTML element is the collection of start tag, end tag and the contents in between. So here, this line is the title element. Now save the file with HTML extension. Now if I open the HTML file, it will open in our default web browser. So this is our first HTML web page. Here you can see the path of the HTML file. And this is the title of the web page, that we have written within the title element. And these are the text, that we have written within the body element. Now if we want to edit our HTML file, we have to right click on the file, and select open with, and then select notepad, or any of the text editors. Let's see what will be displayed, if we don't give any title to the web page. As you can see, the file name is displayed in place of title. We can add comments in our HTML code. These comments will not be displayed on the web page. Actually, comments are used for explanation to anyone who reads the HTML code. Comments are more useful, when a group of people are working on a big web page. So, you can explain the purpose of any HTML element, mention the names of the team members, working on a specific part of the web page, etc. You can add comments in your HTML code like this, As you can see, the comments are not displayed in the web page. You can also view the HTML code, in the browser. Just right click anywhere in the web page, and select view page source. You can also use the keyboard shortcut Ctrl plus U. That's all for this video. In the next video, you will learn about some basic elements, like headings, paragraphs, etc. If you have any queries, let me know in the comments section.
And if you think my videos are informative, then subscribe to the channel, and hit the bell icon, for latest updates. Thank you.